In this video, we are going to talk about top 10 places to visit in 2022. So before starting this video, please like this video and subscribe to our channel for the future updates. As immunizations were more widely available in the spring and borders gradually opened during the summer and fall, our vacation calendars began to fill up once more. Now that we're looking ahead to 2022, it's evident that our travel priorities have shifted. We're no longer ticking off destinations on a map. Instead, we're thinking about why we're going on a vacation and how our actions will affect local communities while we're there. These shifts in thought are reflected in this year's list of the greatest locations to visit, we've grouped these areas together based on some of our favorite reasons to travel, like exciting food and drink scenes, historic sites to see, and fresh places to soak up the sun. We hope it makes it easier for you to plan your next major trip and helps you decide which of the 22 intriguing sites on our 2022 list to visit first. Here's a list of the top 10 places to visit in 2022. Let's start. Number 10. Costa Esmeralda, Sardinia. At Marriott's four hotels on the Costa Esmeralda, the flashy Italian destination known for its Caribbean-like beaches and luxury resorts, you're sure to see Europe's pro athlete and sailing groups. Its opulent hotel called Di Volp has been gradually renovating rooms and adding new eating options, including the Herod Suite, which has a roof terrace and a sea-facing plunge pool, and Beef Bar's first Italian location. The entire region is a billionaire experience, but Formula One and entertainment magnate Flavio Briator coined the phrase for his new eating and nightlife complex in Porto Servo's fancy shopping district. In June, the Baglioni Resort Sardinia opened one hour south in San Teodoro, facing the magnificent Tavalara Marine Reserve, for a more low-key, family-friendly retreat. Nina Ruggiero, number 9. Walt Disney World. The world's most magical celebration, Walt Disney World's 18-month 50th anniversary celebration that began on October 1st will last through 2022, with charming touches and highly anticipated ride and hotel launches. Beginning March 1, Star Wars Galactic Star Cruiser will provide immersive two-night adventures in a galaxy far, far away. Guests will wield lightsabers, sleep on the ship, rub shoulders with Star Wars characters, eat intergalactic cuisine, and possibly go on a secret mission as part of the interactive, choose-your-own-adventure experience, making this a truly unique experience that you won't find anywhere else in the world. The Guardians of the Galaxy Cosmic Rewind Indoor Coaster at Epcot is set to open in summer 2022. Number 8. Burgundy, France. Burgundy is known for, you guessed it, Burgundy wine, but that's not the only reason to visit in 2022. The site Internationale de la Gastronomie at Duvin, international city of gastronomy and wine, an immense complex including a cooking school, a new hotel, a handful of restaurants, and a wine cellar with over 250 by the glass choices, will open in the spring in Dijon, the region's major city. The new project is located at the start of Burgundy's famous wine road, the Route des Grands Cross, which stretches from Dijon to Saint-Denis and produces some of the country's most well-known wines, including Pinot Noir, Chardonnay, and Sauvignon Blanc. Number 7. Budapest, Hungary. Few cities in the world can match Budapest's combination of old-world charm and beautiful modernity, and Madeld Palace, Budapest's newest 130-room luxury hotel, is one of them. The UNESCO-protected Neo-Baroque Palace-turned-hotel, which opened this summer in the city's District V, previously housed the city's monarchy. Spago, Wolfgang Punk's renowned restaurant, is now located within the hotel and is the first of its sort in Central Europe. Enjoy a glass of Kik Franco's or Kadarka at Tegeler Borber Buda, a recently opened wine bar in the Castle District founded by one of Hungary's most known winemaking families. Visit Marlu, a biodynamic wine barn near the Hungarian State Opera, and Portobello, an unobtrusive coffee and natural wine bar around the corner from Adeld Palace, before you leave the city. Number 6. Belize. Belize is a popular destination for adventure visitors due to its rainforests and divers who visit the Great Blue Hole and Huge Barrier Reef. It also has a number of informal locations and a few luxury facilities. The Alea Belize, an autograph collection hotel in San Pedro, Ambergris Cay, is the most recent addition, having opened in mid-2021 with plans to expand its already vast guest room, suite, and oceanfront villa amenities. Major airlines are also realizing the destination's potential, offering non-stop flights and easy connections from most major American cities. 
Alaska Airlines added non-stop service from Los Angeles and Seattle to Belize City in November, and Frontier will begin weekly non-stop flights from Denver and Orlando, in addition to United and Delta's non-stop flights from Houston and Atlanta, respectively. Number 5. Barbados. Barbados has it all, whether you want a calm all-inclusive holiday or a bustling vacation loaded with restaurants and nightlife. The pedestrian-friendly South Coast, which is brimming with new resorts and eateries, is a prime example of this. The O2 Beach Club and Spa is an all-inclusive resort located on Dover Beach's White Sands, with three pools, six dining options, seven bars, and the Aqua Spa, which includes the island's only hammam treatment area. Sandals and Sea Breeze Beach House are among the other opulent South Coast hotels. Head along the coast to Worthing Square Dining Garden, an outdoor food hall with 20 vendors providing dishes from all over the Caribbean, if you can tear yourself away from the resort pools. Alternatively, take a stroll down the mile-long boardwalk for easy access to oceanfront cuisine and drinks at local favorites such as Champers, Salt Cafe, Tiki Bar, and Chill Cafe and Bar. Number 4. Antarctica. After nearly two years without seeing humans, the pandemic shutdown created a compelling reason to visit Antarctica in 2022, observe how the whales, seals, and penguins react. New polar-class expedition ships and new routes to the White Continent are further reasons to bring your boots. With new, twin 378-passenger adventure ships, Viking expeditions will be in Antarctica for the first time in 2022. As the first hybrid electric ship fueled by liquefied natural gas, Ponant's new 270-passenger Le Commandant Charcot introduces eco-friendly sailing rather than heavy fuel. Two eight-seat twin-engine helicopters atop Quark Expedition's long-awaited 199-passenger ultramarine deliver exhilarating heli-hiking trips. Between ice explorations aboard the opulent new all-sweet 200-passenger Crystal Endeavor, try your luck at the craps table. Silver Sea Cruise's opulent, all-sweet, 144-passenger ship Silver Explorer is back, and this time there's a new way to travel, to board the ship, skip the renowned, for rough water, Drake Passage and take a private aeroplane directly from Chile to Antarctica. Number 3. Anguilla. With American Airlines operating the first ever non-stop, direct route from Miami on December 11, getting to this laid-back Caribbean jewel is easier than ever. Trade Wind Aviation has also restarted service to the island with private charter planes. The Aurora Anguilla Resort and Golf Club, which newly opened, has a fleet of aircraft to transport visitors from major U.S. cities. Chef Abram Bissell, formerly of Eleven Madison Park, The Nomad, and The Modern, will head a few eateries at the enormous luxury resort. Quintessence, a boutique luxury resort with amenities such as butler service and a 4-1 staff to guest ratio, is launching Quinn, a more priced annex of suites, in 2022. Along with a champagne cellar tasting room and art bar. Number 2. Alaska. Several enthusiastic U.S. travelers turned to Alaska when many foreign borders closed in the last two years. The huge state, known for its towering, snow-capped peaks, unspoiled wilderness, massive national parks, and colorful locals, provided a dynamic getaway that didn't require a passport. However, when the 49th state's borders reopen, interest in the state shows no signs of waning. According to early projections, more than 1.57 million cruise ship passengers could visit southeast Alaska in summer 2022, according to Alaska's tourist board. This is an increase of 18 percent over the previous record year of 2019. After a non-existent 2020 and a shortened 2021, many long-time favorite cruise lines, such as Holland America, will be returning to full strength. Others, such as Windstar Cruises, Uncruise, and Hertigraton, are introducing new ships or launching new itineraries. On dry land, Alaska will witness a slew of new attractions and events. Number 1. Abruzzo, Italy. Abruzzo, Italy, has long been one of the country's most ignored destinations, despite its pristine villages, gorgeous Trabacchi coast, and stunning natural getaways. It stretches from the heart of the Apennines to the Adriatic Sea on the peninsula's southeastern edge. It has, however, transformed from a sleepy underdog to an ambitious forerunner of leisurely travel, sustainable gastronomy, and conscientious hospitality in recent years. In 2019, Villa Corallo, a 19th-century villa near Civitello del Tronto, became a five-star hotel. 
Dimmer Montaigne, an eco-lodge in Magellan National Park that debuted in 2020, combines glamping with environmentally friendly amenities and a zero-waste strategy. Restaurants like Bottega Culinaria in San Vito Chiatino and Materia Prima in Castel di Sangro, meanwhile, are redefining the region as one of Italy's most exciting food hotspots with their innovative and sustainable takes on local produce and traditional dishes. What do you think of our video? Let me know in the comment section below. If you enjoy this video and want to hear from me again, be sure to hit that subscribe button before you go. Thanks for watching.